I have always been uneasy driving alone at night. But it was the worst the first few times when I had just gotten my license. But the nagging fear has never gone away to this day. It's disorienting to look into the mirrors and see nothing. And I mean nothing but the consuming blackness of the night. It makes me hesitant to check the mirrors should I see the dark void, or worse, someone sitting in my back seat staring at me. In the summer of 2013, I found myself driving home alone on the highway 902 from a party. It was almost midnight, and needless to say, it was pitch black. As was usual at night, I was on edge. I had the radio off, and I could hear nothing but the muffled roar of the tires on the pavement and the dull hum of the engine. I stole a glance at the rearview mirror, but saw nothing but darkness through the black window. I know that I looked backward and saw nothing. I'm sure of it. Just the seemingly endless blackness of the night. I remember it so clearly because not ten seconds later, a car passed me to the left, headlights on. I had one of these sudden adrenaline rushes, like when you think you see a person outside your bedroom window when it's just a tree, or when you start awake at night with a feeling of falling. Ten seconds earlier, nothing had been behind me. Suddenly, a car. I drove all the way home, shivering and knowing something was off. The next morning, I found two sets of scratches on the back of my van. One was on the left rear, one on the right. The car was pretty old. They could have been there for months, but this was the first time that I had distinctly remembered seeing them. In hindsight, there are two possibilities for what happened that night. Possibility 1. By some glitch in reality, or something paranormal, the other car had somehow appeared behind me within 10 seconds of me checking the mirror. Like some weird ghost crap or something. However, the second option is what made my blood run cold, whenever I consider it. It didn't even occur to me until months after the fact, but it makes me dread driving alone at night even more. Possibility 2. The car was normal. It had approached me from the rear and passed me to my left. However, something large and wide and as black as the night had clung to the rear of my car, obstructing my view and the window leaving deep scratches on the sides, and I had inadvertently driven home with me.